Hi, this is Kelly Brown, and today we're going to talk about auto fitting in Excel. So, what does auto fit mean? Auto fit means it's a way for Excel to expand columns and rows to fit the largest piece of data in that column or row. As we look at the data that's available to us here, we see a lot of crowding. The columns are crowded, the rows are crowded, I can't quite see what everything's going on here. In this column, a zip column, I have 3E plus 08. That's Excel's way of telling us that that column is too narrow for the data that's in there. So I want to do something that I can size it out really quickly and not have to go step by step. I know I do see some people where they'll just click and drag a column over to the right to expand a column and while that works because for what you can see it doesn't work for what you can see. This particular worksheet has about 1800 records in it and I have to scroll all the way down to make sure that what I how I expand the column will fit whatever else is in the worksheet and I don't have time for that. So I'm going to let Excel do that for me and that's called auto fit. I'm going to select all the cells in the worksheet so I can auto fit all the columns and rows at the same time. Well, I do have to do the columns auto fit and then I have to do the rows auto fit. So I do have to do those separately, but it's still very quick. First thing I need to do is select all the cells in the worksheet. To do that, I'm going to go to what I call as a select all box. It's over here. It's in the upper left corner of the data. It's to the left of column A and above row 1. It's this little box right here where there's a little triangle. I'm going to click on that box and when I click on it, all the cells in the worksheet are now selected. With that, I will now auto fit the columns. And what I need to do is go to any of the column letters between and in the column letters, not the data, the column letters. When I go up to the column letters, I'm going to go in between any two columns and wait until I see that double-sided arrow. See, this is, a, this is a down arrow, then there's a double-sided arrow. I need to see the double-sided arrow, and when I do, I'm going to double-click with my left mouse button. Double-click, one, two, and when I double-clicked, it expanded all the columns to the largest piece of data in the column. Excel did that for me. Now, that looks a lot better, but I still have some crowding with my rows, so I need to do the same thing for rows. I'm going to go to the row numbers, not the data, the row numbers. I'm going to wait and go between any two rows and wait till I see that double-sided arrow. When I see the double-sided arrow, I'm going to double-click with my left mouse button. One, two, and now I've expanded the rows. So now, my data looks a lot cleaner. I can see it all well and I can get going with what I need to do with it. That's called auto fitting. 